today. Me media for so almost so no every person be a jiji one more for. Look at it, how these kids were being teased, were being what tear gas and some straight bullet onto them. Look at how these kids are lying on the floor and everything. Ambulance take them. A person, and this was what was brought into our school, and then was um, shot straight to our um, students. We can see it here. We we have the pictures. We have our evidences. This we have a number on it, and then we 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 hope that what is being said into our media service is not true. This wasn't a rubber bullet. This is actually a bullet that was thrown directly through our students in our very institution, and we hope that the necessary stakeholders and the institutions will also. Um, come to our aid and then let us have the justice to be done to um, all for our um, so inshallah. Thank you very much. And we are here with the students, some want to speak. So. Did you uh, did you read the press statement released by the what the uh, the police officers in Ghana, the Ghana police? They lied to the media. They said what? They said some of the police officers and some of the students were injured and are take are been, they have been taken to the hospital. Which police officer were taken? This is uh, the video. This is the evidence. We haven't seen no police officer who were shot or something. This case were even on arm. Okay, come so when you are not what I saw for hospital room, I was going to say about who's here. They say I'm looking for some of my rooms, they open some of your day. Then I'm somewhere. On the my budget about this town. Tell me, I won't be getting my no be a father by the and coffee. Simple, no, no, and then that's it. But that's it. Police, when they see a DV plate, that is a what a hot kick food for them. Some of the police officers, when they see a what or registered vehicle, DP, DV, or um, any other plate, that is the hot kick. That is where they get their food. Some of the police, not all of them. Some of them, when they see a motorcycle, when they see a watch, a boboya or a data, all this stuff, you know, most of these vehicles or movable vehicles were used, some of them were used by we, the Muslims, or the Zongo communities. And most of them, you know, they, some of us, we, even the Zongo community, some of us, you know, we don't have driver license driving a car. You don't have a driving license for driving a motorcycle. You don't have a driving license for driving a day day. Simple question. Can the IGP of Ghana, Dampari, or any government appointee in Ghana, or anybody in Ghana, answer these three questions or four questions? We need an evidence. If you can provide me with this evidence, that means you will call it uh, security personnel in uh, Ghana. I'm a security personnel in uh, Ghana. As some of our can see videos on our social media about what is going on, the killing and the shooting by the police forces, you know, or the security personnel, you know. I said, 
What did the Muslims do to you? What did the Zongo Muslims or other Muslims in Ghana do to you? Anytime you heard the name about a name of a Muslim, you just want to shoot and kill because everything we our leaders say Allah yakau, Allah yakau. We need to get a police, the po pol police forces or even other security forces. Some of them are just recruited based on political what affiliation. Some of them are not even qualified to be among people. Before you become a police officer or before you become a what a security personnel, you the leaders know better. Some of them did not go to the school for what a, a police school. Some of them, some of them were not properly trained. Some of them were recruited because of politically of, of affiliation. Some of them don't even know the reality of using a what a firearm. A late the Ghana IGP, Mr. Dampari. When you came, you, know, you was doing a great job, which a lot of Ghanaians applaud to you for what you are doing. But later on, no, it turned up a little bit. Say, most of what you are doing and the rest of the police department of Ghana as a whole, no, it looked like it's a, like a social media show or let's say Facebook fame or social media blogging. That is what other people may see it. Mr. Dampari, um, people may blame you for what is happening in Ghana. Some people. Because all this violence, all this police brutality, most of this police personnel or security personnel are unprofessional. Look at what just especially leadership. I'm going to respect leadership. Okay. Halifa. Halifa. Okay, Halifa. Yeah, Halifa. Senior man, Halifa. I want to be on the Islam. What touching Islam? I know don't talk. Sir. Halifa. Halifa. We be a. 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 We be and so Halifa, social media, and so I need to drop a bottle. Brother Khalifa. Alhamdulillah, wa salatu wa salam ala Rasulillah. Yo, Yako, where? Bung, 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 bung